You ain't gotta cross your knees Shawty, I'ma always ride out Even when we pass your need Shawty, I'm yours and mine now Hi guys, it's me B. Welcome back to my channel. I was just in the middle of cleaning my makeup brushes and I decided that I should film a video one time to show you guys how I clean my million and one <laughs> makeup brushes. Now I got this makeup brush cleaner, I believe it was in Walmart or Five Below. I got two in a pack, I do not remember the price. Um, I already started cleansing some of my brushes. I usually start off by soaking my foundation brushes in some warm water just to loosen up the foundation that was there. This is one of the brushes that I already scrubbed. It still has dirt in it, but the warm water helps lift the dirt out of it. And I also use Dawn dishwasher liquid. I know it's not a Dawn bottle because the Dawn bottle that we have is a gallon bottle and it's too big to use while we wash ways. So I use, we just pour it into a smaller squeezy bottle. So what I usually do, I place my two fingers inside of this. I add a very small drop of Dawn. You don't need much because it lathers a lot. And I have this brush here that I haven't cleaned as yet. So it's very dirty. And I just basically work it on this nice scrubbing pad to get all that foundation and dirt and oil out of my brush the same method basically applies for my other eyeshadow brushes I don't really soak them because I don't use or put on eyeshadow as much as I would put on foundation so those brushes don't really have to soak switch to my other foundation brush This is my mom's foundation brush. I just said I'll do her a favor and clean it. <laughs> Can you see what this is splattering? I don't know what she does with this. Like, the bristles are all over the place. I think this brush needs to be thrown out. I'll try to see how much I can rescue it, but there's no guarantee. Do you see how much foundation that it could possibly be, be within our pores? Like, Yo. Right, I'm gonna return. I'm gonna return this to the warm water. I'm gonna go back, rinse off. Actually, I'm just gonna switch. I'm gonna switch and use my other brush cleanser and go back to the ones that I did before just to pass it again it's nice and clean just how I like it you see the motion I'm doing I'm trying to I'm doing it in a circular motion to clean the middle of the brush and then I rub the sides to bring it back to its original shape. So you see my bristles are still brown. That means it needs some more cleaning. Usually foundation stains a bit, so my bristles may have a slight tinge of brown to it. Next up, I'm gonna show you guys how I do one of my eyeshadow brushes. I'm gonna do like two so you guys can see how I do it. I wet the brushes a little bit. and it's easy peasy <laughs> it doesn't take much work for my next video i'm not sure if i'm gonna put if i'm gonna put it in this video or if i do a separate one i think i'll do a separate one i'm gonna show you guys how i clean my used eyelashes i 
I usually try to clean my makeup brushes. <laughs> I'm a bit ashamed of saying this, but I try to clean them <laughs> once a month. Because I have three, I have three foundation brushes. So sometimes I would use one brush for like a month and then go on to another brush. So after three months, when I find that they are very, very dirty, <laughs> I'm kind of ashamed to say this. But yeah, when I find that they are very, very dirty, all three of them, that's when I would um, clean them, like what I'm doing now. My babies are clean. I'm gonna finish the dress off camera, then I'll come back to show you guys my next step. So I now have my very clean brushes here. And well, it was too much of it inside the bowl, so I have some on a napkin here. I usually take some napkin and I would dry out the brush on the napkin like this. This also helps to keep the shape of the brush or to restore the shape of the brush. This is my foundation brush. Remember I live in the Caribbean and we have roosters and chickens all over. So excuse the background noise. But yeah, this is my foundation brush. And I know you guys can see that there's some foundation still in the brush. Like listen, I've been scrubbing this brush. It'll stay just like that. I guess to alleviate the amount of buildup that I have in my foundation brushes, I would definitely need to wash it more often because sis, that ain't it. I, I've also seen YouTubers using like Johnson and Johnson's baby wash. You can use any soap, any soap that any liquid soap that you have. That's okay. So for my next step, I'm just going to spread out the brushes so that they can dry. I usually leave them overnight so that they can dry properly. I'll just put up my brushes into makeup brushes. This is foundation brushes or my large brushes. And that's it guys I'm done guys so I'm gonna leave them here to air dry outside and that'll be it these are my babies they are all nice and clean now like yes except this one this one is a little bit discolored still as i said i take very long to clean my brushes because i don't wear makeup that often anymore because of the mask we now have to wear i don't like to see a dirty mask so i just stop wearing makeup so to get rid of this i'll need to clean my brushes more often just to get rid of the very deep deep build up thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like subscribe share check out my other videos down in my description box See you again for our next video. Bye. Depot on the beach.